We are approaching a day where the state honors a Hawaii prince. But Prince Kuhio was more than just Hawaiian royalty. Kamaka Pili explains in tonight's Aloha Authentic. In Hawaii, names are very important as they tell a story that includes our roadways. Do you know the meaning of the street that you live on? Well, our weekly Aloha Authentic segment, we highlight various streets across the Pai Aina so we can dig into those names and in turn, learn something new about this very special place. This week, we celebrate the birthday of the only royal member to become a U.S. congressman. In the Ahupua'a of Waikiki, which lies in the moku of Kona here on Oahu, stands a busy roadway named in honor of the royal, nicknamed Prince Cupid. We're talking about Kuhio Avenue. Jonah Kuhio Kalaniana Ole Piikoi was born on Kauai in 1871. His great-grandfather was King Kaumualii, the last ruling chief of Kauai. He was adopted by his mother's sister, Queen Kapiolani, the wife and queen consort to King David Kalakaua. When Kalakaua ascended the throne as king of the Hawaiian kingdom, he declared Kuhio and his brothers royal princes. Never becoming king himself, Kuhio found another avenue to strengthen the Hawaiian people as U.S. congressman. When the prince arrived in Washington, D.C. in 1903 as Hawaii's second delegate, his name became a topic of discussion. President Theodore Roosevelt was dismayed by the idea of Prince Kuhio being presented at the White House. He refused to refer to Kuhio as Prince Cupid and could not pronounce his last name. So Mr. Kuhio was settled upon. Over the next 20 years, Prince Kuhio advocated for Hawaiians on a national level, especially for their land. Some of his accomplishments include our current county system, the Hawaiian Civic Clubs, and the Hawaiian Homelands. Prince Kuhio was given the last state funeral for an ali'i following his passing. Today, we honor the prince annually with Prince Kuhio Day, an official state holiday held every March 26th, marking his birthday. Did you know? Now you do.